I'm Mariah Diedrich. I'm the principal here at Tozer Primary. So Character Counts is a character education program that we use in Waldari 4 that highlights the graduate profile and the life skills area. I'm Amanda Olmstead and I am the school counselor here at Mountain View Elementary. There are six pillars of character. We have our trustworthiness and respect, responsibility, fairness, caring, and citizenship. Um, CUBS is an acronym that we've developed to create something that's easy for our students to remember with some common language um, that ties to character counts. My name is Lucy, my teacher is Ms. Weiss, and I'm in second grade. Um, the C stands for caring, the U stands for understanding, the B stands for be a listener, and the S stands for safe. ROAR is new this year. Kids have really um, latched on to that and they know that we're to be roaring in the halls and roaring in the cafeteria. My name is Tara and my teacher is Mrs. Stricker. ROAR is respect, organization, achieve, responsibility. Every day we are really looking for those positive behaviors, waiting patiently, helping other kids when they need help, holding doors for each other. I see them just following our school expectations of, of being a student and making sure it's a positive learning environment. Being a cub is being a good person and following the rules, listening, raising your hand, not shouting out. Hi, my name is Finn and I'm in Mrs. Weiss's class. I always be a listener to my classmates and my teacher, my friends, family. We have a partnership with our school resource officer and we do a Cougar of the Week. And he comes in and he provides a certificate and everything for our students who are nominated for demonstrating the character that we're looking for here at our school. My name's Pascal. My grade is fourth. And I'm in Miss Jordan's class. I think it means to me it's like caring to be fair and honest. Character counts impacts their academic success. When you learn how to work well with others, that's just, it's huge. Um, so they're able to learn more, they can create more, they're sharing ideas, um, and learning how to do that respectfully. Being a good person means that you respect people, no bullying, and making sure other people stay happy along with yourself. I picked up school trash around the school because I knew it wasn't good for animals and stuff. And then more people decided to do that and now there's like a whole trash club here. But I also do it at my house. Me and my brother just get gloves and a trash bag and walk around the neighborhood cleaning up trash. The data that we get from the Character Count Survey, we review that data. Um, we want to know um, where kids feel like they're being empowered and supported, and same for when parents have filled that out as well. Um, we want to understand their perspective. That helps us to adjust um, maybe our focus for the coming year. I think one of the best things about Tozer is we are an inclusive school and we have a lot of students with different needs. Last year we had second graders that went on a field trip and it just so happened that there was a child there that had um, some different needs and the mom shared with a teacher that she had never seen kids that he didn't know come up to him and play with him and how there was like numerous kids in that class that went over to him and included him in, the, in playing. And so it's not just about teaching it every single day, it's about living it. And I feel like by the time our kids are in second grade, they've been here and they've lived it and they're applying it in real world situations. To be like nice to people, caring, like all of the cub things, it just feels so good to me to be a good person. Being a good cub, it makes me feel good about myself and also it just makes me want to do it a lot more. It's incredibly rewarding and it really does make an impact um, on our students, not just today, but I really do believe it's going to shape them into who they are um, as they progress throughout the grades and, and into their life.